turn this over. I got interrupted. Um, this is Funk Blasters versus Tree Forest 2 on Viaduct, week one of UGC Platinum Highlander. I'll try to keep the view models on so it's clear. Um, I went the opposite way of my demo at the beginning of the mid fight because I didn't want to take the same spam as him, but then he ended up crossing onto the side I was going anyway, so it didn't really matter. Um, I wanted to keep the scout off of him because the demo wasn't far enough forward to shoot, but then when the soldier jumped he became a priority target. The fact that I got sniped was kind of unavoidable on Viaduct because you can't stay out of the sight lines. I cannot turn my view model back on, I'm sorry. I just get it by a direct hit, crazy. So I see the flanks to the left here and I want to focus them with my soldier who's sitting in that tunnel. The direct hit has a lot of trouble hitting scouts so at long range, so I'm trying to not engage him too much. Uh, the combo's moving in on the right side. I should not be as far forward as I am, and I'm backing out now. Um, they exchange ubers, I don't have great health, kind of stay out of this one. Um, but the spy here is someone to shoot. He gets away. Uh, their demo's overextending into us to get our med. He does get him, but I still want to get that kill, but not if it means running through stickies. So I try to get up here, see their scout, shoot him a bit. Very nearly kill him. I want to try to finish the kill, but I can't. So I'm not going to get killed for that. At this point, I probably should have gone back to resupply. Left that kit there for whoever needed it and maybe gotten with our medic and built faster. Alright, I'm kinda chilling with the medic here, I wanna go back to the flank though. Now that I have health. I really needed to be on that spy, but I heard the mini and I'm just like, whatever. Their flank's close on the left, so I was thinking they were gonna push forward and I would hide in that corner, but... No one moved, and I don't wanna hide for too long and bait my team, so... I immediately get out of that corner and shoot the pyro. He was the closest target. It was actually valuable. Um, this Uber is happening. I can kind of get him behind him because I'm thinking if I can waste one of the demo stickies, then I did something good. And then I get on the sniper because there's no one with him. This heavy's chasing me. I want to get the heck out of his range here. Oh my god, the Natasha. I forgot he did that. <laughs> that was incredible. Anyway, I couldn't finish off the medic. And I tried to get out, but it didn't work. I should have stayed in knowing if I had known he had the Natasha. Alright, we have 10%. I believe they have some minor advantage over us right now. Doesn't really matter. We have the point though, and that's very good for us. Times are going to be about even by the time they push again, so we're not really behind. I know the demo's on the left and the scout's up there, so their flank is pretty weak. I want to peek in here. Scout's rotated. He's hurt a lot. When I saw the 75 damage on him and he kn I knew he didn't have a buff, I went for it and Rhino gets that crazy trick stab. You can see his p rec thing. <laughs> okay, they're pushing in. I'm gonna get out of this one. Yeah, keep my medic building. I don't know if I actually use the basher or not. I may not have it on. Just making sure he has someone to heal. Okay, they're on our cliff. I'm gonna fight that scout because I know that I can. Like, I've historically throughout this match and a few scrims known that I can fight him and he's not like crazy good. So when I have a buff, I'm not afraid of him. So I get that one kill. I want to kill the combo, but since we're so close to Uber, I don't want to die. I try to go in with that Uber there because it was called for me to go in and I just don't get the flash soon enough with that mini and the body shot happening like that. Okay, we're losing a lot to that sniper, so like, right now sniper's on my mind, I kinda wanna kill him. We'll see if it's possible though, it doesn't look like it. I saw the scout running over here and then I see my medic is running away, I'm thinking maybe he's on him, but he gets killed I think. I'm gonna clean up on that burning soldier. I can't do it, I go in too far again. I don't really know how to deal with the Natasha because I've never had to play against it. I'm kind of learning as the match goes on, and I think he stops using it at one point. 
But yeah, it, it's making it a lot harder to dodge things like the direct hit and sticky bombs. Working the flank here, but their flank's on the right side, so I don't really need to be here until that pyro shows up. I'm thinking the least I can do is take away their dispenser, but pyro hurts me before I can do that. Flank is retaking the left side. I'm gonna get on the soldier from above. Ooh, free spy kill. Yeah, the spy does lock me in place and I get damaged a lot. They've Ubered. I'm staying out of this again. Um, the Heavy is the only one getting Ubered right now, so I'm kind of just completely avoiding the Uber. Um, that Soldier kill was kind of a give, a, like a free given kill. This Pyro, I don't really know why he's not air blasting me or anything. He might be out of ammo for a Slimthrower. But if he had air blasted me, I wouldn't have made it out at all. Oh. Yeah, I went in too fast. I should have known the soldier was going to be there and that he had a direct hit. I couldn't take a single shot. Usually if I know my opponent can one-shot me, I don't even pick the fight. That doesn't apply to snipers, actually. But just like, if you see like a lock and load or something like that, or you have like 90 health facing a demo who has pipes, I usually don't risk it. Um, here we just gotta keep numbers on the point. Let this cap time fade. So that's what I'm doing. I'm just staying out here waiting for the bombs. And no one gets there in time, so we're good. Right, next round, I want a better mid where I don't get sniped. I'm still gonna get a buff. I'm still gonna try to push in the side that my demo doesn't push in. Um, it seems like I'm going all the way long here. To completely evade whatever spam he picks up. But yeah, the soldier gets really aggressive. I focus him, kind of deny him from getting in. The demo's crossing on the right. He's really far forward. I'm thinking I want to put spam on him, but not if we're not in a position to do anything about it. I want to see if I can catch where this spy is going, but I'm not able to do that. Yeah, they've, they've taken control of the point. I just want to hold this left area. I'm uh, going for a heal while I can. I'm taking a lot of damage. Might as well just get resup, save the medic's healing. He just lost Sniper. I'm thinking if their Sniper gets really aggressive, he might be able to be picked. Um, it's been a while since we actually played this match, so I don't remember a lot of what I was thinking at certain times. Anyway, that soldier around that corner I did not expect to die to that quickly. This heavy's pretty far forward, start shooting him and the pyro. Pyro's farther forward, so I start hitting him instead. Either way, I did some damage to the combo. Our mini's gone. I want to stay on this left side here. Like, I should be doing that. I don't know why I'm not. I think I was the only one. Alright, yeah, their soldier's taking out the mini, so... Right now, they're all, they're all on the right side. So that means I can just use the rock as cover and I get the point for free. That was an, an excellent reflect from Finna. Um, this jump up here is pretty good. I do it a lot. I don't do it enough in this match. I really should have done it more. But it gives you the positioning pretty quickly where they don't expect to have to fight you. I knew that Mini had taken damage, so I come in to kill it. And then we clean up their flank as a team there. Their soldier's down there. He's going to want to shoot me, but the direct hit kind of sucks at that kind of situation. And then I get a sniper pick, which will help us get a lot of time on the point. Cause it'll be a while before we die to a thick class now. There's the medic on Cliff. I don't think anyone sees me on him, so I go in for him. And now I want to get out. Make a brief stop to shoot that soldier. That scout doesn't feel confident chasing me, so I make it out. He probably would have died too. The spy on us. I feel like we're in a pretty good situation right now. Like we're behind on time, but we have everything else that we need. Like we just picked up two kills. Oh, and then we lost a combo class and an engineer, which is surprisingly 
useful on Viduct. I think it's a really undervalued pick. And then we lose demo too, and they basically get this point now. I wanna I wanna go in and force them right now. My medic. He heals he ubers me way too late. And then puts all the Uber on the heavy who wasn't really taking any damage. So I was unloaded and the heavy wasn't able to do much. Kind of a fail Uber there. I don't even know if we forced them. I wasn't not paying attention to that. When I cross uh, doorways like that, I like to check the corners just to make sure there's not a spy camping it. We managed to have the point again right now, which is good. This demo is way too far forward, that's a pick. And without a demo, the push is going to kind of suck, so... Going back to passive mode here. Uh, flank is on the left, contest them. Oh, I see he got launched up, so that means he's low. And then I move forward farther than I normally would, and I get the kill. Back out as soon as there's a pyro. And the pyro and scout are both kind of pushing in on the f that. Yeah, I, I don't know if that was just the flog that hit me that fast, because I had the pocket pistol on. But yeah, I died a lot faster than I wanted to. We have a minute and 30 left to take this back, and we have our medic up. I'm thinking this should be a pretty simple case of building an uber and trying to push without losing any numbers. So that's what we're doing here. I need to be on the left right now. I should not be over here. I think I'm getting ready to sack in. Yeah, I am. And then I get stuck on this mini, but at least I save our soldier from getting caught on the mini. Anyway, I wasn't able to go all the way in. Neither was he. Here's their scout. I don't have any reason to be picking this fight because I have less health than him and, like, no support. I see a lot of people looking left. I should not be walking into this choke with the demo looking at it. If you notice, I'm making a point of, like, bumping into that dispenser every time I walk by it. Okay, that uber I did not expect to get on me. We pop them. I'm getting behind them here because they're down enough numbers that there's no one back here. And I'm gonna be more useful not dying to the over here. I wanna clean up this medic. Alright, that's good. Heavy down too. Focus this flog pyre before he kills me. Very good. Honestly, this round looks like it should be ours. That... yeah, I shouldn't have completely whiffed the second shot like that. I should not be dying for this medic either. That was really stupid. Oh, man, they're, they're spy killing our demo, I think. All those random just pick class things happening. That's what lost us the round. In addition to me dying. Yeah, this is too slow for our heavy glasses to get there. We lose this. Yeah, look at that. Like, just you get hit by the body shot and then the mini and then the scatter gun. It's just instant death. Terrible. Alright, hopefully I take a more direct route on this mid. I want to go through cliff. Okay, he goes left. I'm going left. He's walking up the left side. I'm just gonna wait for the scout there. And I get him. Well, I mean, like, I intercept him, but I don't actually kill him. I get sniped again, though. Yeah, same thing as the first mid. I'm shooting the scout when he's close, then I'm trying to focus a soldier. I don't do very much damage to either of them, though, because not hitting shots and didn't have much time to hit either. Scout's pressuring our engineer. If I'm next to a mini, I win any scout 1v1. Because it's not a 1v1 anymore. That's kind of what I'm thinking when I stand there. Um, just pressuring on this engineer. I hope he's lit so I can get a kill on him, but probably not. My idea of shooting that mini there was make it so one rocket can kill it. 
know their Pyro's watching me right now when I did that jump, so he's gonna rotate to try to like catch me on China. But I end up walking into the combo anyway. Sniper gets our demo right as we were trying to hold. Pretty much loses us that push. And then he gets our medic too. I don't know if that was a case of not backing out fast enough or just he had nowhere to go. The direct hit gives us another flank pick without losing any health. We get that scout. Their flank is weak, but they have a mini up, so I can't do anything with that spot right now. It covers the entire map. Like, I I'm cleaning up in this demo, and it's still shooting me the entire way until it goes down. Um, can I get this medic too? Oh no, it was close though. I think I landed a shot on him way right after he Ubered. So their Uber's forced, they lost players. A repush would be good for us, but we're losing good time right now. I'm missing everything right now. Okay, we got him. And this, I, I love this because the scout just kind of walked into that pistol that I wasn't even going for him with. And then the soldier picks a fight with me when he had low health and nothing loaded. So he goes down too. I want to fight this heavy, but like, not when he's revved and staring at me. And the pyro makes that impossibility, so... I back up. I did do like 200 to that heavy though, so that's useful. Makes him have to sit in the house and eat for a little bit. Here's the soldier again. He's got teleporter particles, so I'm thinking teleporter somewhere. Somewhere in the back of my head, I'm thinking to-do list, kill that. Heavy's moving really far forward here with the demo. I'm putting damage on both of them, but it's not going to be enough because we don't have anyone else fighting. I just want them to be a little bit less courageous about peeking and killing my gamers. That's what that damage is for. I know there's a mini around the right corner. And I just say, I don't care, I'm going in. And I do, what was that, like 250 to that demo? Very close to killing him. I've always been really bad at dodging stickies though. Scout's behind our combo, I miss a lot on this guy. He actually gets our medic there because I'm terrible. Heavy up there. Yeah, I mean, I I'm trying to put the chip damage on there, not like bait my team and go for the cleanup pick. Like, the glory frag after they're dead. Like, I get the medic. If I can get out of this room alive, that would be great. But I didn't go up the stairs when I needed to. I was kind of worried that they'd be predicting me to do that, so my only hope of like getting out alive was to just do what they don't want me to do. Well, do what they don't expect me to do, I guess. But then they just fight me normally and don't expect me to run out the door, so it was all completely wasted. Here I want a buff. I'm gonna shoot that mini so Kuhn can move. He seemed really pinned down. The heavy sees me go up here. He's shooting me, but the sniper is still there anyway. I know that scout's around me, so I immediately wrap around the rock when I turn that corner, just so it's harder to kill me. I'm just thinking about, if I were him, I'd be running away and still trying to shoot the scout. So I'm like, he's not going to be close, but I need to cut off the sightline. Yeah, and then I kill the spy and die to the sniper, which is kind of unavoidable there. Oh well. Like, in order to save our sniper, I kind of had to die there. Walk into the sightline, I didn't have to die. So let's see what I do here. Alright, Engineer, caught out, easy kill. Not easy, but <laughs> you know what I mean. It, it's a kill and I know I can do it. Uh, Demo and Soldier are both fighting on the left here. We need to fight this. 
Or at least get our medic out. Yeah, we are, we're very close to Uber. I want to re-push with this Uber. But we need our demo, and that's what we need. So we're going to start moving forward here. We go up the cliff for some reason. I think it's because the sniper's watching. Anyway, I think I go in and get dropped. No, I don't. Okay. But I really suck at killing that pyro. And I probably shouldn't have even gone after him. Soldier's dead. That's very good. I should not be focusing the medic. Then they pop. Yeah, looks like they're going to take this. Because we didn't get the force on their medic. We, when we re-pushed like that, when we went up around cliff, we gave them so much time to back out that they were not in a position where we could get them. I don't think that's what what ended the round for us. It was just like a a call that didn't make sense because we didn't have time for that. Shooting the soldier, I know he jumps every mid. That time I completely stall him so he isn't able to get into our combo. That means nobody has to turn their eyes backward, everyone is just focused on the fight. Our soldier is like breaking into their flank, so I'm trying to support him, but I just I can't do it. I have no health. Yeah, he ends up dying eventually, but he's wasting their flanks to him for a very long time. It's a cap for us. If these guys stayed in, I would kill one of them. They don't. Um, the police sniper's on the right? Yeah. I thought he would be walking his way into China, but he wasn't there yet. I, I should have chased that spy when I knew there was a spicicle. him He's peppering away. Oh, I'm burning again. I don't like burning. I think that's a uh, scorch shot or something was it? Anyway I'm fucking out of here. No one's watching the left. I want to go in but this is bad. There's no way out of that. Yeah, Pyro's is completely right about Rhino's bind. He uses the meat shot thing every time he gets like a kill that he thinks is impressive, and it's like, come on, man. But don't do that. They're shooting up Cliff. I know heavies are pretty easy to kill when they don't see you, but the thing is, there was both a mini and a demo that were both focusing me. Just wasn't okay. I guess I assumed the demo was on Cliff with them because it wasn't really called that he wasn't. Okay, here the sniper killing my NG, getting out of there. I'm gonna put some cap time on because they're not in position to shoot me if I'm on the left side of the point. The sniper right there was the only one who could have. Now the spy is in main and I see that. I fuck up that jump that I was going for to get out of China. So, I know Spy's on the left side of point, cloaked with low health. Yeah, this demo needs to die. No, he gets out. Come on. Come on, man. Oh my god. And then I make it out of that. Just, just, shout out to the pocket pistol. The soldier wants the med pick really badly. But he doesn't realize he's jumping the pyro with only projectile weapons. Which is just a terrible idea every time. I go all the way in here because my medic says go in. And I, I go in. And <laughs> it doesn't work out very well. I guess he was happy with the fact that we had forced them off the point without using Uber while I wanted to get their medic while they didn't have it.
Scout saw me on fire, so he thinks I'm lit, so he chases the kill. But I w was buffed and on fire, so I was totally fine. Unfortunately, he had his whole team with him. This demo is a free kill. Um, he does get our medic, though, with a lucky pipe or a roller or something. That kind of range, I don't know, demo probably shouldn't get a kill on a medic. And the soldier just gets me in a spot where I can't dodge. There's the snow time. And we're in that situation again where we, we're not going to have Uber in time. We don't really know what to do. We just, we let them have too much time is the problem. Wow, that was really bad. There have been a lot of situations where I walk into the flank and I just take one good rocket and then it's just over. There's a second half to that too. I, I don't, I think, yeah, we switched sides, but I haven't really changed anything in my strategy. Yeah, we lost soldier early. Um, I see that he's AFK. I'm not gonna go for the kill on him, because it's kind of stupid. And then he times out anyway. I remember someone called me out on not shooting the AFK scout, but whatever. Oh my god, this this is the best pause of all time, because this bind spam just keeps happening. Alright, let's see if we can fast forward a bit. Uh, is that as far as it goes? Okay, okay, there I'm pausing. Alright, full speed. We lose heavy after the unpause, we lose sniper, this is really bad. And the score is currently 3 to 1, I think. So we really can't afford to be losing rounds here. Every mid has got to be a good one, so... Scout is like way the fuck in. I I wanna keep him from leaving. And the pistol just misses every shot. Okay. My aim wasn't perfect, but I feel like it was good enough to land at least one bullet. Jumped over that health kit because I thought someone else needed it, but I don't think that was actually the case. Um, I do that jump over that bridge and I get the sniper. Now I'm behind their combo, the pyro sees me, but he can't do anything about it. He's running flog because his ping was really bad. That mini is just trapping me in, so I have no way out. I'm gonna go over here, try to get this health kit, then run out through tunnel. Where the mini won't shoot me. They do eventually get the mini, and then I just get immediately on point. Sniper on right is good for us because it means he can't do that much. If he tries to peek it, he'll usually be able to be like a pretty easy kill. And we do kill him. Uh, I see that they're all gathering on the rock like that and I'm just thinking like, alright, they're gonna push. So we have advance warning, we uber way too soon. We should not be going into them like this. I'm trying to save our sniper from the soldier and I do that. I personally think that Yash is better than Seabass in general, so felt like keeping him alive from the non-sniper threats was a very valuable thing to do, to keep their sniper down. Uh, 
I don't remember what I just said nice to. I know it wasn't a sarcastic thing, because, like, I had no problems with the way these guys were playing in this match, and they were pretty friendly. Try not to talk shit about friendly people. <laughs> Alright, so... Snipers on China, so this is kind of a shitty place to peek, but I'm doing it anyway because I know that the sniper is there and my sniper is there, and I kind of want to be a distraction. All that's happening right now is just a sniper v sniper, and we want to. Whoever gets the picks is going to win this exchange. And our sniper just can't hit him for some extended period of time, and then. That happens. We have Uber, but we have numbers down, and then we use anyway. Eh. Not a real fan of that plan. We do get their sniper. Um, spy on our demo, I call this out. Turns around, very good. Um, I'm gonna, I wanna go in, but then that mini's there. Like, I really wanted to chase that heavy, make sure he doesn't get out. So, and that's what I'm doing now. But, I kinda whiff one of those shots there and... lets him survive long enough to kill our pyro. I want to go up on the China again, and then just kind of sit there and hold, but I fucked that up twice. I'm just not going to try anymore. Find the Spy? I think we... yeah, we tracked him to death. Their right's open, except for that mini, so... I do come in from behind the Soldier. Which works. I'm too far in, but I get the demo, so I consider it good. I really do think I should have backed out sooner. We have Uber. Um, we're gonna retake this, I believe. Well, not retake, like, take ground back. We have the point. I wanna check if that's a real death, but our engineer needed the metal, I guess. So he runs into it too. Soldiers on the right, that's a big ol' problem. I'm not fighting it with 120 in this range. It, like it, it just can't be done. Their demo went in for the med pick, which would have won them the round had he got it. But um, he doesn't get it, and it actually is seriously a problem for them because now they don't have a demo, and we just kind of walk on point. I'm going up on China, sniper pick, very very good. I'm pressuring them because I know their pyro can't really fight me right now. He's using weird loadouts and hasn't been much of a dominant force at all. Um, I try hiding up here for once because I know this is going to be one of those situations where they all clump up and rush. And the moment I jump up and peek, I just get blasted by everything. It was unlucky that they were looking right at me when I did that. Perhaps there was a shadow glitch, perhaps the spy was calling it, I don't know. We have 10 seconds, we have a demo, and I think we just popped Uber on point. Yeah, there wasn't anything they could do there. Tunnel the visioning really hard, but it does get the kill. We also got their soldier. Oh, I went in too far. See, that would have been really good if our demo was up front spamming stickies in on him, but he probably wasn't loaded at the time, or didn't have health. I mean, if, if he was spamming that demo, I mean that heavy, then the heavy would have gone down super fast because he's not moving anywhere. He's just spun up and not dealing damage to our demo, so he's like a really easy kill. And then we can just push forward on that, because I probably wouldn't have died either. Like, that was the plan. It just didn't happen. And then that exact same ha thing happens, where, like, the pyro just happens to be flaming me the moment I jump up there. putting spam out on the demo, but then I get popped up and then it's kind of over from there. Right. 
That's a sniper pick on their medic, and we're very happy about that. Here we Uber in. I don't know why our heavy gets any of this Uber. He should be staying out. Same with our pyro. Like, that was just weird. I know Spy just sort of spicicled away. I'm thinking about him, just probably not as hard as I should be. Okay, I see the dot on the ground. I see their combo walking in left. I'm gonna just waste their ammo, waste their buffs, whatever. Chip at them. The thing is, we have a minute and 30. That's half the round already won. If we give this up, that's totally fine by me. Trying to fight the scout, but I miss a lot of shots in a row. Now that our engineer's here, I'm gonna re peek, but. Oh, the scout's chasing. I wanna chase him. It This just does not turn out very well for me. Oh, wait, yes, it does. Never mind. <laughs> I was thinking that was gonna be terrible. Alright, coming back. They don't have a flank. Um, but they're Ubered in on our left. I'm thinking, can I get this demo before he gets out? Yeah, I can get it. The pyro gets me. He's back on degreaser, I think. I'm a lot more worried about him than I was when he was on flog. Scouts on the right. Uh, can I get behind them? No, they know I'm here. I'm not gonna commit. But they don't react to the fact that I'm here, so I'm thinking they don't actually know. I come up here, Angie dead, Sniper dead, and then it, that just kind of played itself. Easy game, right? Now that the mini's gone, I can try to get out. Unfortunately, the heavy's kind of watching one way, the demo's watching the other way. I don't think I can get out, so I run at their medic. This doesn't work. I think I may have botched a pick by Rhino there. Um, their sniper disconnects here, and they've already paused this half, so they don't use a pause. I, I'm saying in level like, hey, should we pause for them? And they're just like, no, 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 that's not. Okay. It's not wrong, but I feel like it would be best to give them a proper chance. Point is, I'm not going to argue with my team in match. We're just kind of in a really basic position right now. We, ha we have, I think, most, if not all, of our numbers, and so do they. We're just sitting here waiting for them to push, I think. The thing is, we're gaining time while their sniper's not here, and it's kind of like it for free right now. This is free time that we get. They popped in right before their sniper's back. Um, I want to try to attack them while they're fleeing. Yeah, I get the medic. Killing that mini lets me get out. Shooting that soldier's good. The spy just killed our medic, I think. Yeah, that's not good. But we do have such a time advantage over them now that we should be able to repush this. No matter when they get it. Um, that demo will barely be up again this round. From that death. That's really good. We also killed Scout and Pyro with our sniper. We're on quick fix. I love when our medic's on quick fix because he'll heal, he will heal me more because it makes him harder to hit. Oh, the valley into medic. I'm apologizing about the fact that we couldn't give them a pause or just didn't or whatever. Kind of acknowledging that we won that round partially because of the disconnect. Ouch. He, he gets me there. I think I was thinking that was gonna miss, so <laughs> that was a brave trick stab attempt. I respect that. There, like if you saw Rhino, he just sapped a teleporter and then went in to pick the medic. I feel like sapping that teleporter gave him away and made it kind of impossible to pick the medic. I would never have known that. Here, I'm hoping the scout's low enough because he's like running toward where the health kits are that he'll die. But he's not. I'm gonna go up on their cliff. Hiding right here has not worked out for me. So I'm just peeking. I'm not gonna sit there. 
see the sniper's watching, but I also know the soldier's in here and I need to kill him. What I did there is I tried to put as much distance between me and him as I could after like the initial shot that I did. The thought was, maybe if he hits me for 139 I'll be okay. Because <laughs> the direct hit does 140 point blank. That's exactly how much health I had. But like, you can't really back up in that closet. I wasn't willing to let him get away. The scout comes after me because he thinks that I'm low and he has full health, but... I hit my shots and he doesn't. The heavy too. Soldiers hurt. Basically, like, we, we can kill them right now with what we have. Then they back up and we basically have a reset. A reset in favor of us because we have the point. Oh no. Yeah. I I'm sitting there and taking demo spam and then I try to kill the spy and then the scout walks in. That was tunnel vision. I should have been out. I think our demo is spending too much time loading pipes that are just going to be spammed anyway. Yeah, I would just be doing that with stickies if I were him. Here, I really really suck. Like, I almost let him get a pick. If he was on, if he was on at that particular moment, he would have just killed our medic. Would have been my fault. Okay, they are pushing in from the left a little, but they're not like committing yet. But now they are. We have like half the cap time and I'm thinking like I'm gonna try to just continue that. But then the medic's on the point alone, basically. Get him. I want this demo. Can I get this demo? Okay, Finna gets him for me. I'm staying in here when I should be backing out because I know that soldier's lit and he might kill my pyro at any moment. So killing him would be very valuable. I was crouching there because I was worried about like a, a scatter gun ticking me for like three. I don't want to overcommit to kill this guy, so I'm, I'm on my way out and then I get stopped in that doorway. Ruber kind of got stuffed there. I don't think they've used, so... They have Uber over us, I think, but we also have a minute and 50 seconds over them. I don't know where that spy goes. Alright, there's stuff happening over here. I want to find out what it is. I don't really like what's going on over here, so I just kind of rotate up there. I get the sniper and the soldier. They're all pushing as a team right now. Eat. Our medic needs to be farther back. I'm not happy with that. My thought was that the sniper pick there was worth my life because it would allow me to allow our team to get more picks, play more aggressively. See my spy fighting this pyro, and I'm just thinking, hey, I can help him out, save his life, and I get the pyro. I should not have done that. That was dumb. That was just a waste of my health. Anyway, they think I'm a lot more lit than I am, so they're like spending a lot of. They're like pressuring me really hard. Like that scout jumps in and shoots me first. That sniper was sniping me, the soldier was expending ammo on me. So that was kind of interesting. Oh, the mini. It's on the right and no one's shooting it right now. Oh, I think that was like the spy's fault entirely that he missed that stab. He really kind of should have killed our heavy. Okay, the mini's gone, and I'm trying to move in, keep their heavy down. Yeah, we get the cap, that's good. Heavy, I'm gonna engage. It kills me though. I thought engaging that heavy is that if we kill this heavy, their medic won't be able to get out alive, but he does. It doesn't really matter though, because when they get out, they end up losing. Alright, that was a pretty good match, I think, because it showed that we adjusted our strategy over time to account for what was going wrong. Like, we stopped dying as much to Sniper and Spy and all that silly stuff.
And I think it actually showed pretty decent scout play for Viaduct. Alright, thank you for watching.